Well, this is a story all about how we turned our food chains upside down And I'd like to take a minute, watch until the end I'll tell you how deforestation hurts our animal friends In Southern America, there you'll find Tropical rainforest filled with life, you know, animals maxing, relaxing, all cool and all grabbing some sun. Right outside the pool when a couple of farmers are up to no good. Started cutting trees in my forest hood. And now trees over there are rare to be seen and over 130 species a day go extinct. With near all the trees gone, animals soon followed suit. Trees gone, herbivores and carnivores too, cause animals die when they have no food and in the food chain trees are the ones that produce. Let's summarize. Cut enough trees and animals go extinct, but humans need wood so our economy won't sink. Somehow there has to be a balancing way. Come on, let's all ride the tree saving train. Well, you see that animals aren't the only thing this problem affects because trees suck carbon which don't matter except that carbon is the reason for the greenhouse effect, yet another reason why our trees we must protect. In order to live, carbon is needed by trees, it's part of photosynthesis, it's their food you see, but cutting trees down without the carbon they stored unless carbon is a goal to work towards. Carbon is part of the protective layer that traps the heat from the sun into the air. To survive in the future, a solution we'll need and we continue to cut our one defense, the trees. Humans are weird. It's the main reason and cause for global warming. The temperature rises, therefore destroying even more habitats as the temperature is offset and this is why we need trees on our planet. All of this does seem pretty hopeless, but there's a solution, so don't lose hope yet. All we need to do is replant the trees. If we can do that, the rest should be a breeze. The logging companies have started already. Selectively cutting and planting back steady, it helps to counteract the trees that we've lost. It's an effective solution that we've long sought. It isn't perfect though. It still has its flaws. Reduction half to wood slow down. The economy will drop, but it's a small price to pay to help our planet. So now all we have to do is help companies plan it. In conclusion, deforestation can be genocide. Cutting down trees kills the animals inside, but we can help by replanting them. It's sane, so come on, let's all ride the tree saving train. Thank <laughs> you.